Yeah, I mean, I, I felt good today. Um, you know, Mac did a good job of you know calling and mixing uh, four seamers and two seamers. And I think that was kind of the, the key today. Uh, was being able to you know throw that four seamer and then throw the two seamer off of it. Uh, I thought the slider was good and, and the changeup as well. So uh, I think the biggest thing was though uh, I've been working on trying to get the ball down in the zone a little more, uh, especially my sinker and get a little more sink on it than run. Uh, and I think we did that today. Career high and swings and misses for you. Um, <clears throat> you know what, what is the main byproduct of that, or not the byproduct, of, but but leading to that? Is that just the effectiveness of all your pitches right now, keeping everybody guess? Yeah, I think it's just command. Uh, you know, when we can command the ball down in the zone, uh, it opens up up in the zone. But if you live up in the zone and you try to climb the ladder with the two strikes or something, you know, they, they've seen that. You know, but when you change your eye level up and down constantly, then uh, they're more likely to. Uh, not be as on the, the four seam up in the zone. So I think that was kind of the biggest thing today. I didn't know if you had a blister or what the situation was when they came out to see you, but Gardner said that it was probably a cramp. What, what, can you explain a little bit what you were feeling? Yeah, just, I mean, hands cramping up a little bit. I don't know if it was dehydration or what, but, um, you know, they asked me if I was okay. I kind of told uh, Matt Rankin in the dugout after the fifth that it was kind of cramping up and it just kind of. Uh, Kind of gets my thumb. Kind of feels like it's creeping up on the baseball. But after the the half inning in the dugout, after the fifth, it was fine. And then back out for the sixth, I just stretched it a little bit. So they came out there and asked me if I was alright. I said absolutely. Um, you know, so everything everything was good, and uh, just glad to get out of that last inning. But uh, I've got no problem with that. I think it was just a little dehydration, maybe a little more water, a little more a little more bananas too. So right before that that meeting, you had. It was a runner on, nobody down, and you went 3-0 to Gregory Polanco and able to get to 6-4-3. I know you always have appreciation for your middle in infielders behind you, but in that particular situation where the game might have tilted a little bit, how, how important was that? That was big, and that's why I threw a sinker in that, in that count right there because uh, if I throw a four seam, you know, he's probably all over. I know he's a, he's a hacker, so he could be swinging 3-0 there, but, uh, you know, I'm glad Machi and, and, and Iglesias were, were ready for it as well. So, uh, yeah, that was a big play in the game, and, and that's what kept it 0-0. With your competitive fire, how much do you appreciate or look forward to, to matchups like today against a guy like Nova when you guys are pretty much matching each other half any for half any, where it's like, hey, who's, who's going to blink first? Well, I thought we swung the bats well today. Um, you know, they got, we got Nova in some jams uh, from the first inning. Uh, we just hadn't, couldn't have that big hit today, and, you know, but uh, you know, our hitters are doing a great job. They really are. They're, they're putting the barrel on balls. They had a, Moran had a couple nice plays. Rodriguez had a couple nice plays. They were just defending really well. Uh, and you just got to give their hats off, hats off to them. But I thought our hitters, their approach is good. Uh, they've been swinging the bats hot this series, and, and they have really all season. So, you know, I think the, the, the timely hits will come. Um, but you got to tip your hat to Nova and, and Vasquez and, you know, ultimately their defense for making the plays when, when they mattered. You can shut down a team with few strikeouts, but when you have strikeouts like you had today, it's indicative of where your pitches were going, though. At least it is from afar. Does that, do you have the same disposition toward that? Uh, that yeah, this is, a, this is a, a gear up today that I was throwing. Uh, you know, I just try to get deep in the game, and, you know, I would like to go on a couple, couple innings deeper, but, um, you know, the pitch down just kind of got caught up to me. Uh, I don't think I was erratic. I thought I went right after guys. But like I said, I think just the command today was a lot better as far as down in the zone, exactly what we've been, what we've been working on, and uh, it's good to see it pay off today. Again, your pitches were moving more like you wanted today, or was this really all about command? Uh, a little bit of both. Uh, I think the slider was good. The slider was down in the zone, throwing it for strikes, but uh, I think just the four-seam and two-seam mix was, was big for me today. Considering you've been trying to change the shape and speed of that slider, do you think this is the best it's been so far? Uh, Results-wise, yes. Um, I left a couple that were uh, more on the plate that they either swung through or took, but uh, I'd like it more kind of a quality strike down and away. But uh, you, know, you can't really be perfect, so uh, you know, I'll take it and kind of work on it in my next bullpen session and go from there.